Hey guys, welcome back to podcast nine and three quarters. I'm your host, the Half-Blood Princess. In this video, I'm going to talk about why Sirius Black was sent to Azkaban. But before I get started, if you love Harry Potter as much as I do, be sure to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up. We are introduced to Sirius Black in the third Harry Potter, Prisoner of Azkaban. Everyone believes he's a mass murderer who betrayed Harry's parents to the dark side. But as the story unfolds, Harry slowly learns that this is not at all what it seems. Sirius was framed and wrongfully imprisoned. The truth of what happened on Halloween night 1981 is finally revealed. When Sybil Trelawney's prophecy about the baby who would destroy Voldemort came out, James and Lily Potter were forced to go into hiding under the protection of the Fidelius charm. Originally, the plan was for Sirius to be the couple's secret keeper, as there was no one in the world James trusted more. But Sirius worried that Voldemort would quickly target him as his closeness with James was no secret. Without telling anyone, including Remus or Dumbledore, Sirius and the Potters made Peter Pettigrew the secret keeper instead, reasoning that no one would suspect the mousy little man of holding such an important role. And this proved to be one of the most fatal mistakes of Sirius Black's life. Peter, it turned out, was a coward who folded the instant Voldemort turned an eye toward him. Fearing for his life, he betrayed the Potters, leading to their death and the orphaning of baby Harry. Of course, the attack on the Potters' house had famously devastating and unexpected consequences for the Dark Lord, leaving Peter in a rather awkward position, with his true master unable to protect him and his betrayal on the verge of being exposed, he made the desperate decision to frame Sirius for his crimes. In the hours after the Potter's death, Sirius confronts Peter Pettigrew on a street full of muggles, but he was prepared. He loudly claimed Sirius for betraying James before casting an explosive spell that killed 12 muggle bystanders at the same time. He transformed into his rat animagus form, escaping unseen and leaving a severed finger behind as proof of his demise. Sirius was left with a dozen bodies, witnesses who had seen the whole thing, and nowhere to run. Peter's plan worked, and Sirius was sent to Azkaban. Even though Sirius was eventually able to escape Azkaban, his life was never the same, and he had to remain in hiding and his name was never publicly cleared while he was alive, but those closest to him, Harry, Remus, and the rest of the Order of the Phoenix, knew the truth and protected him throughout his final years. Sirius is definitely a fan favorite character, and it's easy to see why. His loyalty throughout Harry Potter never wavered. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section, and be sure to like and subscribe. Okay, love you, bye!